Hey guys, Jason here. I am presenting another lead guitar lesson video and I'm gonna talk about melodic speed picking today. So we'll go over the lesson that I have and then I've got a beer tasting after that, so stay tuned. <laughs> Alrighty, so that wraps it up for this week's Melodic Metal Lead Riff. Now, if you go back through my library of videos, you'll probably notice that a lot of my guitar lessons and videos are based on melodic metal, melodic riffs and that sort of thing. And that's because, well, it's what I prefer to play and write. And it's actually a lot of what I listen to. And I'll give you an example. Like right now, it seems my two favorite bands at this moment are Nightwish and Amon Marth. Now, they're both metal bands, but they're both very different metal bands, or they're different subgenres, if you will. However, both bands are very melodic in nature, so I just tend to like that, so that's what you'll see a lot of coming from my videos. So anyway, I'm gonna put this up, and you're probably wondering, hmm, what's Jason drinking today? Well, I'm glad you asked. Today I am drinking what I consider one of my go-to IPA beers, and that is Cigar City's Highlight little green can. You guys have probably seen this in prior videos because again it's one of my go-to IPAs. Now the reason for that and you know taste, good taste is relative. I mean what's good to me you might not like and vice versa but the reason I like this beer is everything that I think in my opinion an IPA should be. It's got the bite, it's got the kick, the IPA part, what you would expect, is very prevalent, it's very strong. And uh, it does have a unique flavor to it, and I like the aftertaste, and it's 7.5%. So all those things considered, and just my personal opinion, it's just one of my favorite IPAs. So, let's have a sip, as we say in Thai. Chum chum, that means cheers. Mmm. So, Two or three of these and you're you're feeling pretty good quite feeling beer as well <laughs> so i hope you guys enjoyed the video today and um there will be more coming down the pipe i try to put one out each week i am working on some special projects right now i think i told you guys in my last video that i've got a christmas single that i'm, I'm trying to release i'm running into some complications um with the rights it's it's not really a cover song because I'm not playing it note for note, not even close. And so I really can't call it a rendition. So I'm going through some red tape to try to make sure, you know, if I'm going to owe royalties to, you know, the original songwriter for this, that, you know, they get what's due to them. I'm a big believer in that as a small time musician. So hopefully I will finish that and I'll be able to release this by November 1st. I also have a huge project that I'm working on for next year for 2017. So stay tuned for that as well. Until next time, keep it metal.